going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome to more Monster Energy Supercross 2, the official video game. Um, we are on our second race of the Custom 40 Championship, and this is going to be Season 4, guys. Um, and it's already off to a great start because I got my first win of the season, and I am currently the points leader. But we are on Dakar, the second race, and it, this track is from Geo... KTM 100 I do believe is what his name is I'm not entirely sure if that's right but there is my character Chris Garcia with the red number plate and the Inferno bike the bike is looking fret well I should say the lava bike actually but we're gonna go ahead and hop into it so as you guys know the rules are 20 second head start every single race realistic AI cyclic weather and medium race length the reason why I have cyclic weather on there is because if by chance we have like an open stadium the weather will just be whatever it wants to be I'm not gonna have it a certain weather or anything like that so it should be fun so let's go ahead and hop into it and uh, I hope you guys enjoy the video and if you guys do enjoy the video at any time make sure you guys leave a like and also subscribe if you are new and make sure you guys turn the bell notification on and look at that we got a bridge going into the start straight so I'm just gonna let the bike sit here and then we're gonna let the timer go up to 20 seconds. And hopefully we can pull off our second win of the season. But yeah guys, so um, I've been away from for a little bit, but now I'm starting to come back and my balloon is some trials rising and stuff like that. So hopefully you guys are enjoying um, those videos. If you guys are enjoying those, make sure you guys once again like and subscribe to the channel and also make sure you guys check out my buddy Goonzig that's a good start um, because he um, does this does all these things kind of things too and also make sure you guys check out his real life writing as well Goonzig Productions so I'll make sure I'll leave his links in the description below now let's try and get ourselves the win bridge there, nice, but yeah, this is going to be a total of 17 races, just like the actual championship and the game for the class, and we are just absolutely messing up left and right, I mean, also, I haven't really been playing this game um, a whole lot, so I'm kind of rusty from it, um, I've been away, and also guys I got some news for you I might end up in moving here soon so the videos are probably going to be stopped for a while until I get my internet because me and my girlfriend we found a place to live and we'll be moving probably this week sometime is what she told me so I will have no internet but I'll try and keep you guys like informed and as well as track I'll try and keep you guys posted and let you know what's going on. With that, she did say that we're going to be moving this week. And we won't have no Wi Fi for a little while, but we're going to try and figure that out. We're trying to do we can figure that out because, you know, your boy needs some Wi Fi to make some videos and some streams and stuff like that. We're already up in 11th place. And I promise you guys, this is unrealistic AI. I, mean, I, I, I promise you. And I promise I'm not cheating. This is because I can't change the settings or nothing once the championship is set. It's set. So whatever the AI is on is what they are on. I do believe from the first race they are on realistic AI. We're in fifth place. We got close to the Brock Tickle. Barsha, it does Barsha, ain't it? Yep, Justin Barsha up front, but not for long. That's a mistake right there. It's not really a whole lot of mistakes, but just some minor ones. I actually like this track, it's actually really cool. 
We still got six minutes left. Before the race is over. So we'll go that. Because I didn't have enough speed to carry on, so I'm just gonna roll it instead of send it. send it every once in a while so I have to go fly it. Sometimes it costs me but other times it don't. I don't have a big old scrubber out there. And also if you guys are on PlayStation make sure you guys check out my one track. Um, it's like it's called Scrub SX or something like that. Um, I want to know like how many points you guys can get on that track. Cause I got quite a bit of points and also I want to know what your guys' longest scrub is from that track. Like, there's only like two jumps in it besides well, there's three because the finish line jump. But there's two jumps in the track and they're for scrubs. So let me know in the comments what your guys' uh, longest scrub is. I think mine was like 200 something. And I got a lot of points off of that. As you guys know, the points, they go towards your SX credits, so. And also, if you have the times two multiplier credit thing that you get for the DLC, that'll help out a lot, too. So you'll end up having a lot of credits. But I just wanted to make that track fun and something different. Ooh, ouch. That looked like And something different, so I figured what better way to have a scrub track so that's what that track is maybe actually check it check it out see if some people might have downloaded it or anything like that because it's different it's not your normal supercross track like it's a track that mainly it's like a time attack track but you're only doing it for scrubbing and stuff like that it's not for actual racing because there's no other jumps in it no whoops nothing like that so it's just three big jumps to, Two regular jumps and then a finish line jump, and that's it. It's just a big old loop. As a matter of fact, I think it's this jump right here, the finish line jump. I think that's what the finish line jump is on the track. Once again, I am in the lead. I think I got a couple boots, stuff for the bikes, I mean, I, I pretty much spent all my money. And also, I'm, I'm on the road to the diamond gear, oh, diamond, diamond stuff, but uh, I gotta work my way back up towards that. Because I'm not even sure exactly how many points I have, like how many credits I have. So there's Weston Pike, who I accidentally tried to kill in the very first race. So, of course, he's going to be back in the pack. Which I am still kind of upset about that, because I honestly did not mean to try and kill Pike. I mean, it, ju it just happened. He got in the way at the wrong time. And I set him flying out his bike and probably did him over his neck. There's Josh Grant. Well, that dude's name is... that <laughs> and also I have been doing the career mode um, I know I've been wanting to do that stuff on stream but I've just been playing the game doing some grinding and stuff like that just just taking some time off you know, I am back as you guys can see I've already uploaded like a couple videos yesterday and I have uploaded the one today but 
and this one probably be going up today as well. But yeah, I've just been doing my own thing, just relaxing and taking some time off of YouTube. But don't worry, I, I'm not going to quit because I love doing this kind of thing. Um, but, um, yeah, I've just been taking my time off because I need it, you know, with work, with actual work, and, you know, with, going, with all this stuff that's going on, not trying to get a place to live, because I currently have to get out of the house in the now, like, as you guys know. A little bit of it, you don't know the whole story, but, you know, it's just, there's a lot of stuff going on, so. That's why I've been kind of away, but now I'm trying to come back and get to feel things again, because I haven't been able to do like, a video. I don't even know how to say half the time. Then I end up messing up on the intros and the outros, and just a bunch of stuff. It's just, yeah. But what can I say? I'm me, so gonna have mistakes, we're gonna have mess ups and stuff like that, but I think it's funny actually. Gotta have some entertainment. Right here we're catching up to Reed, so I'm not sure exactly where Reedy is in the thing, but I know he's not that far from the uh, first place. Ouch, that hurt. Ouch, yeah. That hurt it. I think he's like probably a big pack. Oh, what the heck was that? Baggett Wilson. That was. Oh crap. Oh, yeah, okay. Okay. Any blocks with Freezy. You go down. Dang, man. Everybody's just having difficulties out here. This track was kind of difficult. Okay, so Chattery is ninth. And Benny Boss is coming up to the switch time. Dang it. Well, Benny Boss is definitely above me. Which is actually kind of surprising. We're at our final lap here at the car. That's a tough block. Wow, I was gonna scrub that, but now I'm not. Gosh darn it. <laughs> and these AI, they seem so easy on realistic. Like sometimes they're a challenge, but they just seem I don't know, maybe it's the track? Because they're custom tracks. But for some reason the AI just seems so easy to beat. Even on realistic. But if it was like a regular track or like an official track, then I'd be having a hell of a time. So maybe that's what it is. Maybe it's the custom tracks that are throwing the riders off. Wait, there's a read right there. Alright, it doesn't matter. We got the win. So P1 and another 26 points. On the board. So Cole Seely, Justin Brayton, Jason Anderson, Justin Barsha, Eli Tomac, Blake Baggett, Marvin Miskin, and Chad Reed, Dean Wilson are the top ten. Okay. That's not too bad. It's not too bad. But there you have it, guys. So 52. Po oh wait, yeah. 50, okay, so 52 points. But there you go, that's the end of race number two here at Dakar. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you guys leave a like, subscribe if you are new to make sure you guys turn the bell notifications on, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.